Hi lovelies, welcome back to the number fours of the pip journey or the into the pips. So number four, this is the second part or the part two of the four. So, so the cups and the coins. I will link the previous video where I showed the swords and the staves or the wands and four is coming together of the four elements to create a foundation or the solid solidity the base the basis and the strength of what you can start to build on also the reaching of the first goal or now the solid foundation has been reached or done cups emotions water the feelings Every, everything within us, everything that either flows or is not so smooth but can be ups and downs, how we feel and everything, the emotional everything. So, first one, the Scantis Forza, beautifully patterned stability of emotions. Possibility of growth of emotions into the foundation reached where you can start to build upon now a strong building or the emotional relationship or the, the inner stability if we are not talking about relationship then it means also the inner strength and stability that has been reached which promises the beautiful growth from this point on if the stability is maintained this one also shows, shows pretty much the same as the Marseille deck. Now this one, the moon and the sun and the touching in between also the, what is this, the dusk and the dawn when the moon and the sun are or the night and day are equal and touching each other which is also showing like in Rider White the Four of Wands shows the midsummer day and night where everything is equally balanced so this one tells that our sub subconscious emotions and the way we look out outside the way we appear from the outside is in a beautiful balance and our inner and outer shine is flowing beautifully and has a solid foundation so to speak 
this one as well. The balanced emotions that you can now build on either relationship or the personal growth. Simple four cups without foliage, without everything here you can or have to remember without the image helping you what the four means. In this one the structure the inner and outer are staying together nothing is falling off everything is connected with the the circle of rainbow so this shows also the hidden and the moon and the sun part of, of ourselves and everything that emotions contain that everything is in a beautiful balance and nothing is jeopardizing it because it holds together in a stable structure this one also the person is blowing a two-horned um, instrument showing that the airflow is going into both of those instrument parts equally and this is something that you also have to gain as to learn to keep the wonderful balance between playing this music, the emotions are in a stable connection with this card. Although the cups are not aligned, very stable pattern, I would see this one as a ladder or the steps that help us now to get on the higher level. Something has been reached, the, the skill of balance, of stability has been reached and which allows us now to build the ladder or the steps that allow us to reach the higher goals within ourselves or with the relationship which doesn't mean always love relationship everything human relations this card however shows the strength part of the stability and the four elements coming together, working as one. Everything is supporting this heavy creature of an elephant in a equal way that not, nothing is going to break the perfect working together as a foundation is shown here really beautifully as the elephant is a heavy animal and if the foundation is not strong it wouldn't hold nothing can be weaker than the other 
everything has to be applied in an equal amount. So the temperance-ish thing that it has to be in harmony and and supporting each other. So this card tells about the strength of the situation, the strength of the emotional balance, the, the equal application of every aspect into this situation. This card, however, shows again the balance and it is raised up into onto this pedestal, so to speak. The one cup or the chalice is on the floor two are here and one is held up in there with with balance yet this card celebrates the obtained obtained level of of emotional balance and, and strength, where everything is like on a different level, but still in a perfect harmony with each other, and nothing seems out of place. In this one, you can see the pact Something has been agreed upon in here. So I would read this card differently because this shows the reaching of an agreement, but also it is based on a strong background the agreement can be only obtained when you have been presenting yourself well enough to get this, whatever they are agreeing upon. So here it is. And as it's cups, then I want to say that this will this agreement between different parties is more like something that will allow you to build the foundation or the something that will allow you to build the building because the foundation has been built, it is strong, it is stable and now some kind of an agreement will help you to start the journey of building with the, which will bring the emotional satisfaction because this card for me is not like love related it is more like like other people relations the the two different sides have now agreed to work together this card more or less is like the rider white the unsatisfied man has turned the back on the chalices or cups and the cups are on top of each other so the structure has been built but he is not satisfied with it sometimes this happens as well as we 
built something and we are not quite satisfied with things and we maybe expected more of something from it. So this here shows the, the shadow side of the structure where we are not happy with with the results. So when we reach the end of the pip cards then we will look how the cards influence each other. So for example if we are talking about beautiful foundation on the four then two or the clash of the opposites before the four tells about the possibility of this clash to evolve into a good foundation, good agreement and everything but if the two comes after the four then the foundation or the stability is jeopardized by something disagreement that will occur so these things so right now we are only talking about what one card means but this is like i am showing you the red yarn or the wool yarn but how they are weaving together is only occurring when we are laying out the cards side by side and shuffling them and trying to read them. So, as one card, I don't use the pip cards for the yes or no answers. There's always a story with pip cards and at least two, preferably more cards, should be taken to show what's the real issue or what's going on in the situation is. So, and the last one of the cups is the Pagan Otherworlds based on Rider White, which shows the tree between the rocks and three cups that are already obtained and now fourth is offered but the unsatisfactory or the uninterested feeling of this is not enough or everything. If we are reading this as a Rider White, if not, then with Pips, I would say that as the one cup is on a lower level compared to others, something is needed in order to lift it up to create this foundation and and or pattern. So with this card I want to say that something is yet missing or not worked on enough in order to obtain this, this uh, cooperation of all elements into the foundation. So with this one I would want to say that there's something that needs to be searched, soul searching maybe, or something that needs to be looked into. Because if you look at the tree here, then it is almost grown above this. This, this is the moments before getting out into the sun and 
enjoying the sun, enjoying the warmth and the feelings and everything, but the tree is not there yet. You can't give up. You have to work on it a little bit more in order to reach this better position. So, coins. Again, stability in your material things, in your possessions. The shield on the Morsaidek shows not only the stability but the protection. Your assets are protected because you have built a stable way to maintain this situation. And again, the foliage is in full growth and growing, yet the shield is shielded by the, the foliage which also tells about the need to protect, the need to maintain this situation in order for you to start building your assets, your, your better future on it. But right now as number four is also the divine principle. It tells the divine protection like the universe stands behind you with this situation and you are right now protected because you have maintained or obtained this very stable state This one shows the how the coins are e in this foliage and the beautiful flower blossoming in the between. So everything is giving equal amounts of themselves to this center. This card, card tells about the center, the balance of centered, focused, and growing, blossoming. forgot the English words. The blossoming material state. Now this one shows first of all all the coins looking at each other. Nothing is pointed outwards, everything is focused within and working with each other together in between there's a an anchor and the caduceus anchor international symbol of hope and caduceus as the messenger or the the staff of hermes with the wings and intertwined snakes showing the hope of getting this situation towards the better and the obtained stability in this
cooperation and and um, material stability. In this one, it is rather no. Oh my God, the Marseille-ish, but. Instead of the shield, it has the, I'm not sure, the globe of power, which tells that this material stability is promising and blossoming the power it promises the more powerful situation and also tells about the power and the the order in in this area at this point also if you think about the emperor the stability the, the strength behind the emperor is shown or reflected with this card a lot. Now, this one has the foliage not growing in between the coins, but on top of them. There's vines grapes grapes are symbolizing the fruitfulness of this situation and the promising fruits out of the stability that has been obtained with the material things so stable with a promise of growth and fruit-giving. The same with this one. Grapes on, on the carriage with bulls, strength, stability, growth, beautiful castle, green fields, everything is promising the now incoming growth with this one. In this, all the instruments here are showing the or telling us to celebrate this stability. The coins are protected inside this, this square. They are in the box. They are not falling out. They are protected. Nothing to be worried about. It is as stable as you want to be or as it gets right now and you would want to Allow yourself a little celebration with this, this obtained stability. The beautiful bells around it, so chime your bells and but don't get peacocky. Maintain the balance but celebrate what you have already now obtained. Now this card is absolutely different from all of others, the medieval tarot. You can see, I hope it focuses if my hand wouldn't focus. Please, you can see they are going into war. The swords are up, 
they are the boat is going away from us so it can be read two ways as the maybe the threat is now moving away which allows you to get better stability but the coins are not in a stable formation which tells about not yet gained stability or maybe you are thinking that you are have been building or have obtained the stable foundation but actually it is not so so that threat moving away or the aggression that it will possibly follow because you haven't been able to obtain the stability this is like like crusaders i want to say going out to ravish something so this is trying to maybe obtain the the stability or the growth of your assets by attacking someone else or trying to take it away from someone someone else it is like the dark side of the four where the stability is not built by your own honest means and skills but you are trying to take it away from someone else in a selfish purpose or someone else has been trying to take it away from you hence you have no stability but this situation now is moving away so you can try to fix your foundation and build or get it in balance and in it in its full strength this is quite rider whitish hiding your assets so balance beautiful pattern square yet the balance is obtained but has to be not celebrated but hidden hold close to your your land or hide it from everyone else because something maybe like it this situation like this someone will want to take it away from you or you are afraid that someone will come and shake your balance or take something away from you it can also mean that you have to hide it because you will need it in the future again the other cards and question you had in mind is adding into this and this one the lock or the key and the chest and the tower of coins is a hint to the rider white again yet can be read as you the chest is closed the key is far over there laying on the ground it is not protected your coins are out in there so this might be calling you up to pick up the lock or the key sorry and hide your assets because you can't keep them out there like this 
or it can also mean that the key has been thrown away because right now you don't have to hide but build so you can you can reach a little bit higher with your goals so yeah this is how you read it these were the coins and the cups the video link to the staves and the swords I will leave up here and you can go watch this one if you haven't already and we will meet again with the vibes. Thank you for watching and happy peeping. Bye!